it's important to make sure that students are learning what they need to learn across the course of the school year and that teachers are being held accountable for making sure they introduce that curriculum to them. It is um, useful to have a measure of how students are doing each year so that you can see if students are making the gains they should be making. Um, because if they're not, there may be a problem. They give me the data that I need to build curriculum around what I need children to know. You also want to know, in general, what students' skill levels are so that you can make sure you're aiming instruction where they are rather than aiming it too high or too low where they're going to be less likely to learn. The way of the world is a standardized testing world. You want to get into a, a grad school, you're going to take a test. You want to get into a college, you're going to take a test. There's some higher level thinking skills that we really do feel like, kind of as collectively, as a society, that our students ought to be able to know, do, and show, and showing ultimately on some type of standardized test. One of the great things about Common Core is it's allowed us to have a national conversation about what it means to be college and career ready. So what we've got is a new set of expectations, a new higher standards, and what we're hearing from around the country is, I mean, especially these you know, surveys and polls that you hear, and you know, in conversations that we have with colleagues, it's just what people want and are expecting from school systems. 